in whom you had faith in him. Why do you cry when your father is alive? My name is Raymond Smith. My position is to praise God's name. What is the Raymond Project? The Raymond Project is simply a group of friends. We call ourselves the people of praise. And me, since I'm Raymond, they wanted to make me in charge of the group, so uh, I just called it the Raymond Project. And we just go around singing and teaching about the goodness of Jesus. Uh, I've been singing since the age of six. I was anointed in my mother's womb is what she continues to tell people at 85 years old. I was anointed in her womb to sing and she had me traveling uh, to several different churches all over the Bay Area. And then I joined up with Open Interfaith Gospel Choir and I started traveling um, certain parts of the world. I sing because I'm happy, deep down on the inside. I sing because I'm free, all over, everywhere I look. His eye is on the sparrow. That's the reason why I sing. My goal in this life is to touch everyone that I can, teaching them about the goodness of Jesus and helping them to uh, eternal life. That's what the goal is. Uh, I was inspired at nine years old. The Lord told me that I would travel the world and sing his praise. He came to me in a vision and I really didn't understand it until I got to be 42 years old. I was with Oakland Interfaith. We were over in Australia, Sydney, Australia, and we were uh, walking into the town hall and I was laughing. They used to call me the class clown, so I would laugh and joke, but I was walking into the, uh, they called it the town center, and I was walking in backwards with me and my Auntie Barbara, and when I turned around, this was the building that I saw when I was nine years old. And the cold part, I was talking. Uh, and then I, I walked in, after I stopped talking, I saw they were playing my song. And I knew I wasn't scheduled to sing the song, but I ran up to the stage, which was a no-no. When you're doing sound check, you're not supposed to do that type of thing. But I went up to the stage, uh, and the song that I was singing was Keep On Believing That God Answers Prayer. So I grabbed the mic and I sung the song. And uh, after that, it was just amazing for me because I knew that then that that's where I was supposed to be doing God's business. What is your favorite scripture? My favorite scripture is so many. My goodness, my favorite? What would be my favorite? My favorite, Matthew's the fifth chapter, the 11th and the 12th verse. Blessed are you when men shall revile you and shall persecute you and say all manner of evil against you falsely for my sake. But rejoice and be exceeding glad for great is your reward in heaven for so persecuted they the prophets which were before you. And what, and what exactly does that mean? It means that you should be glad in the times that you are in right now. Whatever it may look like, it's still a blessing. Um, our forefathers came before us and they fought. We're talking about, this is Black History Month, so we talk about Harriet Tugman and, and uh, W.E. Du Bois and those type of people. But uh, it was a fight a long time ago. And that scripture simply says we don't have to fight because the battle is already won and the victory is ours. How can people reach the Raymond Project? Well, listed below on this video, you'll see contact information that you can reach us by email or by Google phone number.